Right, I know you watched the video last week eh, of the teacher showing you how to use this, but this week I prepared a video just so what I'll do is I'll try and make it relevant to the sort of work we do in Coat Nice High School. So what we're going to try and do is record, at the moment, just record one bar of music. And that's what that means there. We've talked about this before in music, how that's a bar of music, and you can see that across there. Obviously it looks different and it doesn't look like sheet music, it doesn't have lines and stuff. But you can see how that's a bar of music, bar one, bar two, bar three. That then is beat one, beat two, beat three, and beat four. And those beats are actually split up into fours as well. That will come to we'll come to that later. Right, so the first thing we're going to do, as you can see here, is I've chosen an electric drum kit. And when you've got the electric drum kit, you can hear all the different sounds. You might have to scroll down and you can hear all the different sounds the drum kit can make. And I'm going to keep things nice and simple and just choose the bass drum. Right? And that's sometimes called the kick drum because you, you, you use your foot and you kick it. Okay, so if I click here, that's beat one of bar one. Now that's not beat two. I move over here and you can see this sort of thicker line down here. And that means that's beat two. Again, thick line. This is beat three where the mouse is pointing. Beat three. And then finally beat four. And I can play that back and we get four beats per bar. Perfect. Perfect. Now, in order to give it some kind of a link when it goes back, I'm going to add in another bass here, so I get a double bass before I go back. Let's see what that sounds like. Okay, that's not too bad, but it's a bit too jumpy. So I'd quite like it to go dum, 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 dum. So what I do is I move it to here, and it should be what I'm looking for. And it is. Okay, right, so that's not too bad. Right, let's put in some snare drum then. Yeah, so the snare drum normally goes on beat two. So let's try that, beat two. Yeah, that's beat two here. Yeah, not bar two, remember that's bar two, beat two. And then try it on beat four. So it's beat two and four. One, two, three, four. Let's see if that works. Perfect, but once again, I'd like, to, I'd like, it a, little, I'd like a little skip in here. So let's see what this sounds like if I put a snare drum just here. So it might skip back to beat one again. That's it. Yep. Yep. I like that. Yep. I like that. Yep. So let's put in some hi-hat. So we've got some closed hi-hat here. Now this is where you can really have some fun. Because I've got this up into quarter beats, I've done this with you before on this program. And I'm going to just choose every single quarter beat, every single one, right? It's going, that's going to give me that thing that you've maybe heard me play sometimes on the drum kit, where I go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Yeah, in quarter beats. So let's hear what that sounds like. That's it. That's what I want. That's perfect. Very good. And I'm actually going to add a little open hi-hat here to see what it sounds like. And let's put it uh, here. Oh, that's not open hi-hat. That's mid-tom. So what I do is I drag that to open hi-hat, drag it up to here. Right, let's see what that sounds like. No, don't like it. Don't like it. So I'm going to highlight that and just click backspace. In fact, I can actually go up here, can't I? I showed you last week where the eraser was. It was up here somewhere, folks, wasn't it? The eraser. There it's there. Erase. So please take it away. And then go back to my pointer. Right, so let's try that again. I still would like something in here. So I'm just going to experiment. What about a shaker? Oh, that might sound quite nice. So let's put the shaker up here. For some reason it's not working. Oh, not one pencil. Put oh, pencil, drop, drop. I think it was one pointer rather than draw. See what I did there, made a mistake. All right, so let's go back to pencil. I'm on pencil, let's try shaker. Yep, it works. So let's try that. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, I 
And because I've got that there, I don't think I need that there. So I'm just going to hit backspace. You could obviously go up to the eraser, but I'm wondering if I could take a shortcut and just press the backspace button, and it works. Oh, I'm doing really well here. Right, right there you go. Right. And just because I'm in the mood, and just because I'm in the mood, I'm going to add some conga drums. Random. Completely random. Let's see what that sounds like. Random conga drums. Ah, absolutely perfect. Right, so, that's what you do. Now, I know last week you looked at all the different compositions and it was good fun, etc. But you need to start to compose your own piece of music. Okay, and that's you starting to compose your own piece of music. Yeah, that sounds quite good. I've got my drum beat. Right, let's try something else. Let's try some bass. So, if I take this down, you can see here I've got some bass. Bass guitar, slap bass, jazz bass. Let's just go with bass. Right? And I'll load up the bass. And I should have the bass round about maybe here. No, why have I not got it here? Let's try it. No bass here. Oh, oh, here we are. Bass down. Well, I should have known that because the notes are down here. Yeah, the notes are down there, so I should have known these are blank. So I should have known that. There you go. Right, you know something? I don't particularly like that sound. So I'm going to see what other bass is available. Let's try bass guitar. Mm, I still don't like that either, actually. I don't like that. So let's see what else I can do. El see, I'm looking for something electronic. So let's try, yeah, let's try something like this. Oh, here we go. Synth bass. Yeah, synthesizer bass or 808 bass. Let's try synth bass. That's what I was looking for all along. And see, this is what you should do. Just experiment with the sound. That's what I'm looking for. Right, so you can see what I'm doing just now. I'm actually composing a piece of music. I'm actually composing something just using the key here. Right, so let's see if I can actually do that. So I've got... That. So let's see if that is what I'm looking for. Let's press play. Right, that is not what I was looking for, but you know something? I actually quite like that. I prefer what I've actually punched in rather than what I've played in. Right, so once again, that's what you do. Perfect, you do something like that. Right, perfect. So I'm now looking for a tune to go along with that. So once again, let's choose a sound. So I quite like that synthesizer sound. So these are all the electronic sounds that I like. In fact, there's one there, synthesizer. So I'll just choose that. So I'm looking maybe for something to go here in between the in between the bass. You know, something would be here. What? Oh, what? Oh, don't I, I can't tell you what. You know, something. I'm going to backspace that. I don't like that sound. So what, where I went wrong there was I just chose synthesizer, but I didn't experiment and hear what it sounded like. Right? But I should have done that first, and I don't like it. I don't like that. So let's try smooth synth. Right, I'm going to come back to that. I quite like that sound, but I don't want it just now, but I quite like it. Right? I have no idea what this is going to sound like. Oh, I like that. That's the one, that's what I'm looking for. That's the one I want. So let's just see if I press play here. Right, so here's a new thing that I'm teaching you today. Notice what I did there. I played back, and this is really, really important that you start to do this. I played back my composition, and what I did was I started to see which notes would sound nice, but I didn't punch them in. I used the keyboard to play, and that's something different from last week. That's the key, because remember, you need to compose music in this particular unit, and that's me composing music. You see what I did there? So I can press play. Do not punch in notes, but play these notes. No, don't like that. Don't like that note. Don't like that note. Don't like that note. I like that. I like that. So this note here was the note I liked. Once again, let's just punch in this note here. 
right? Again, I'll try and make it that when the beat is not being played, so the, sorry, the bass is not being played, see what I'm doing here? When the bass isn't being played, I'm doing this. And let's try that. Don't like it. Move it across. I didn't like that at all. Didn't fit, didn't like it. So we experiment. I did not like that. Let's try this. That's good. It needs to be double in here, I think. Let's try that. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that. Okay, so I'm going to keep that. Let's try, in fact, you know something? I'm actually going to try the experiment. What if I play another note? This is the same sound, but another note on top of that to create harmony. Remember we talked about this on Friday about harmony. So once again, I'm not going to punch in anything just now. I'm just going to press play. No, that does not work. That works. Right. Right, so see what I did there? I discovered that this note here went with that note there. So what I'm going to do is I am going to duplicate that on top and create harmony. Like so. Right. Listen to this. Perfect. Right, now it's time to possibly add in Go back to that smooth synth and I'm going to try something really, 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 really radical and see if I can actually make a long note on top of all of that. So once again, to find the note that fits, I press play. That's not like that. Not like that. Oh, I like that. I like that, right? I like that. So that E6, see what I did there? I found out that that E6 is really nice. So if I click on here, and then, I'm sure the drawing tool will work if I drag the note. Oh, why is that not dragging? Why is that not dragging? Let's delete that. Let's delete that, because be, the man in the video showed us last week how you can drag the note. There you go, I've dragged it. Right, right, and I've got this long note on top, so let's try that. <laughs> Right, a bit too much. Oh, oh, far too much, far too much. So still do the E6, but maybe cut it, maybe cut Oh, why are you not cut short? No, I'm, I'm not dragging it. Oh, shush, shush, shush. Right, so let's try and grab it. Ah, I certainly don't want to do that. Sorry, third year, give me one minute, please. Let's just rub that out, that's just too much. In fact, what I'm going to do, I'm actually just going to rub it out. Right, and then go back to pencil. And then draw it in again. This table, I'm just going to draw it. Oh, that's just great, that, isn't it? I found out how to drag it. There you go. So you can see what I managed to get. I managed to get that little icon to drag it in, right? Done. Okay, I like that. And finally, let's try and make a real proper tune out of all this. So let's try and go pop synth classic. What's that going to sound like? No, do, uh, that might work. Let's try this. Right. I like that note. So let's go with that. That, don't like that. See what I did there? Let's try that. That is rubbish. Mr. Johnson, that is garbage. Right. So let's try the note here. Let's try that. Do you know something? I actually don't like that anymore. See that long note that I was talking about? I don't like that. I'm going to delete it. That's it. That's what I want. No, I don't want that. That's what I want, that's what I want. That's what I want. That's it. Try that. No, that's too quick, so move it back a wee bit. Try that. I think that's what I'm looking for.
That's okay. Right, that's okay. Right, let's try one last thing. Oh, don't do that. That's not what I want. Delete that. Back to pointer tool. No, back to select tool. Sorry, my fault. Select tool. Yeah, select. Let's copy, drag all that. Right, now is this going to work? Is this going to work? Is it copy? Yes, copy. Right. And make sure I'm on pointer to here, possibly. But you can see what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to see if I can paste that along just with a quick copy and paste. So let's see if I can take the pointer. Oh, oh, that's not going to work. Okay, let's try that. Let's just try and paste it then. So I've got copy on, right? Let's try and paste. Right, 50 notes pasted. Drag them to change their position. Well, I don't want to change the position. I want to copy the position. So let's see if I drag this along. Will it work? Back a bit. Mm, went too far. See what that did? I went too far. You took that too far, Mr. Johnson. Took it too far. Uh, copy. No, that's not going to work. You can see what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to copy that across. So let's see if I can... That's the one. Select that. That's it. Yeah, see what I did there? Yeah, I've now got a two-bar a two bar tune. Here we go, let's press play. Right, what's I'm going to do now? Let's change this tune. Keep everything else, but change the tune. This might be rubbish, but it might work. See what I'm doing, I'm moving the notes up a wee bit. See if that works. Mm, it worked up to that point, so let's move them back down a wee bit. That might work, try that. That works, that was okay. Then what I can then do is select them. Yep, yeah, and copy them over to here. Oh, where did the right move and don't move that? Copy them, don't just don't just drag them, copy them. I tell you what, I'm just going to leave it there. That's enough for just now because I've talked too much anyway. Uh, we're quite well on ahead. So that's your target. See what I've just done there? I've made that as a Mr. Johnson tune. It's not rubbish. It's not this garbage that we've seen before. Look, I'll show you. Right, I'll show you. Right, all this sort of stuff. Watch. Right, watch. Uh, oh, where is it? Point A. Uh, right, draw. Uh, absolute nonsense. Yeah, right, just, you know what I mean? See if I can draw my own name, do you know what I mean? If I can do watch, 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 oh, there's that watch. Let's make a mister. Oh, look at this, everybody. Oh, look, oh, look. Oh, mister. Right, oh, mister. Oh, nearly mister that, right, and then mister John. You get the idea, mister Johnston, Jail. No, that is not, that is not what we are looking for. So let's take all of that. And let's hit backspace and delete all of that. What we're looking for is something that sounds like a piece of music. So here, for example, I've got a, I've got a drum kit beat, I've got a bass, I've got a little bit of harmony. I showed you how to do harmony, yeah? And I've got a wee tune. Simple as that. Simple, look. Get the idea? That's what you have to do. Then I could possibly speed it up. Let's speed it up a wee bit. Let's take it up to 120 just to make it a wee bit more interesting. Let's see what it sounds like. And that's your target for today. Okay, thank you very much. Video over. You try it out yourself. Thank you.